so hey guys welcome to my channel malni new fashion so today's video is about our day 8 of free bridal class with certificate so today's topic is eye makeup for beginners i'm dedicating this video to the beginners in eye makeup and you may ask me i am uh, good in eye makeup whether i can watch or not definitely you can watch because there are many general knowledge in this video so now let's get into the video but before getting into the video if you didn't subscribe my channel means please take a moment to subscribe my channel and also click the bell icon as well as and if you are interested in mehendi class means my mother is taking free mehendi class with certificate in her channel so i will give the channel link you can go and join that class also if interested so now let's get into the video so first let me say you the parts of the eyes to apply an eye shadow there are about four i mean about four parts like that so now let me say you the parts name the first part is crease next is lid brow bone and then outer v so these are the four parts in the basic ma makeup eye shadow so these are all the important things also you need the down letters are not need so much for you so let me teach you the four itself so first is crease the crease will be in your eyes where there is a type of line so how to identify that no uh, you have to take a mirror and see down so um you will get to find the crease it's very easy only for you in the pic also you can see where is the crease so next is lid eyelid means the ball uh, while you're closing there only you will be usually applying eye shadow if you're doing the eye shadow before and all means so there will be your eye shadow then the outer v is uh, in the pic you can see there so it's uh, uh, in the eyelid corner so that's in the shape of outer v next is brow bone so which is under your eyebrow that is called brow bone so there only we will be applying concealers and all to um uh, what to say to brighten up your brow bone i mean to highlight your brow bone so now let me say you what are the type of colors you can apply in your eye shadow so in the crease you have to apply matte colors like dark brown uh, uh, like that and all if you apply means it will look so beautiful in the outer we also you have to apply the color which you have been applied to the crease in lid i mean in eyelid that colors can be anything actually uh, that dip can be depends on your occasion or your dress like that it can be depends so these are the colors you have to apply in the brow bone you should not apply any colors so below crease i mean uh, in the crease and below crease itself your eye shadow should be completed it should not come out of it then it, the makeup will not look uh, like nice so guys now let me show you a simple eye shadow makeup uh, just to clarify that uh, where is crease like that and all and uh, now i'm not going to say about any eye shadow brushes what you have to use there's a um separate topic for this in our channel so i'm not going to say now about it and all so you can uh, see when that video is going to be upload so guys now let's start doing the eye shadow but before that let me say you one thing guys you may think me why she is up applying to her itself and showing i am so sorry guys because i am not getting the clients to show their face in the youtube that's the reason why i am not able to show another clients and uh, apply in them and show you i am so sorry guys i hope you will understand my situation uh, definitely you can understand how i am applying and all so if you didn't understand means you can ask me in the comment section and then guys please apply your eye shadow first uh, in your makeup don't first apply in your face the makeup then go to the eye shadow because why i am saying means uh, if you are applying your eye shadow after makeup means uh, sometimes the makeup may fall down the eye shadow may fall down that's why i am saying you first do the eye makeup then go to the face makeup uh, if you are doing wrong means the brides will really get angry so only i am saying you so please understand this first guys you have to apply a primer that means not concealer you have to apply the face primer you are using for your face then when your eye makeup will also be uh, long lasting that's why i'm saying now i'm taking this yuda beauty 
try much to to apply in my eyes i am going to use this so in that they have been written like foundation cc cream before you have to use like that they have been written so it's a primer so now let me apply this and show you After applying it, leave it to absorb for minutes, like one minute, two minutes is enough. So it will absorb, then you can apply your makeup. Next step is you have to apply a concealer. So I'm taking this concealer, it is from Illegal Pro. This is a good concealer also. Then you can also use your eye concealer itself, but this is itself best. You no need to invest in extra concealers and all. That's my opinion for your brights also you can do like that itself so you can use a liquid concealer that is good don't use like a powder or made concealer it is not giving you good coverage that's why i'm saying i have been using this because of the coverage reason only so i have i mean uh, i have been used to the powder concealer then it's not giving a good coverage that's why i'm applying it a little bit and then you have to blend it that's it using the beauty blender blend it next going to use a compact powder to set the uh, foundation and primer so just apply it using a brush or the sponge given in it so you can use whatever you want i am using the sponge and then i am uh, dusting the excess apply them like this and then dust the excess don't forget this step also very important for you then only your eyeshadow will look beautiful and then guys now let me show you how to select the eyeshadow select the eyeshadow which is having these two shades this is very important because you will be applying this in the crease if you are applying another eyeshadow means th that don't look nice that's why i'm saying and friends don't forget to also buy a good eyeshadow palette i will suggest you the jacula palette that palette review have been given in our channel itself you can go and watch link is in the description box guys because that is very nice to use there are many colors that are affordable range the eyeshadow palette is like 400 rupees only now i'm applying the a crease a color in the crease after that i'm using this uh, type of pink because my dress is pink now that's why i'm using this whatever you want you can use and uh, choose the eyeshadow according to your dress and your occasion so i'm using this guys now filling the outer corner also now so tada our simple simple eyeshadow is completed next what i'm going to take is the concealer and i'm going to apply it in the brow bone so then only it will be like highlighted now my eyebrows are not done but also i'm applying it and also what you can do is if your eyeshadow came out of crease means you can apply your concealer and correct that is also the best way so now i'm just uh, highlighting the brow bone now our simple simple very very simple i should have done so i will give you the pick you can see the pick so in that how much difference are there you can see guys the right hand side part is the eye shadow applied part and the left hand side is the not applied part so you can see the bright pinkish so we have been done very 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 light so that's why so in the upcoming videos i will do the great eye shadows and all not great the complimented eye shadows and all so guys this video is that so if you like this video means like and share it this with your eye shadow beginner friends and all so yeah bye now let me see you in the next video